Linux Mint Debian Edition is the second brand of Linux Mint. And in today's video we want to talk about should you still use LMD3 in 2020? Is it still worth using or should you wait for LMD4? Let's go! Linux Mint Debian Edition is the second branch of the Linux Mint project and is other than the regular Linux Mint Edition not based on Ubuntu. Instead, it bases on Debian Linux. Although it comes with the Debian non-free sources, there are some differences between the Ubuntu and the Debian Edition of Linux Mint. On the one hand side, you can't use PPA software repositories on LMDE. On the other hand side, Debian doesn't ship hardware enabling stacks and also no newer kernels and with that no fresh kernel drivers. Only the Cinnamon desktop environment is receiving updates and upgrades from time to time. With LMDE you mainly will get only security updates. On my virtual machine you may see that the windows sometimes looking a little bit washed out although I installed the guest add-ons from VirtualBox. I never faced this on the other distro, so I just want to mention this at this point here. If you want to install LMDE3 on your machine, you first have to download the image from the Linux Mint project site. Just go to linuxmint.com, search for download and then choose LMDE3. For this example we choose 64-bit system. Please keep in mind if you have an older machine your 32-bit um, release is also supported by Linux Mint. In the next step please choose a mirror near to your location and just click on it and download the ESO file. On the bottom you see that the current Linux Mint um, edition is based or its release date is point to August 2018. This means you will receive many updates after installation. Other than the Debian project that is merging the stable editions and its updates from time to time to point releases, LMDE3 ships an initial release build and provides all since August 2018 till now released updates via the Linux Mint update tool. Apart from that after installation and all updates, Cinnamon is coming uh, is on is in release 4.2.4. .4. Let's go to the control center and then system information. Here we got it. The shipped kernel is 4.9.0 minus 11 and for example Firefox is on release 68.4.2 ESR, Thunderbird is on release 68.4.1. After you install the high amount of updates, you mainly receive in future only security updates. This is mainly because of LMDE3 is based on Debian Stretch. In the Debian project speech, this means old stable. In summer 2019, Buster was the successor of Stretch and with that Stretch was moved from stable to old stable. In total, Debian Stretch will be supported five years, but after two years after release, this means you mainly receive just security updates and no new package upgrades. Exceptions are here, for example, Firefox, Thunderbird, and of course, Cinnamon. How the Linux Mint project will handle the upgrade process for LMDE3 to LMDE4 is currently unknown. LMDE3 is expected for release in 2020. Users of the Ubuntu-based edition of Linux Mint knows the Mint upgrade tool. This ensures a smooth and secure update from one Linux Mint main release to
to the next main release. And I personally hope that Linux Mint project will adapt this tool for its Linux Mint Debian Edition users for the LMDE 4 upgrade. In conclusion, I personally never used LMDE 3 as daily driver. I never saw a benefit using LMDE 3 compared to Debian Stable with Cinnamon Desktop. But this may is caused by the fact that I'm a GNOME user. So for me, the Debian shipped Cinnamon release wasn't really important. But who is in love with Debian and Cinnamon may could enjoy the spin of both. Debian um, shipped with Stretch Cinnamon 3.2.7 and with Buster Cinnamon 3.8.8. LMDE 3 provides Lin uh, sorry LMDE 3 provides Cinnamon 4.2.4 and with LM uh, and with Cinnamon 4 many changes and improvements pushed Cinnamon forward. So for Debian and Cinnamon fans. LMDE 3 could be highly recommended. I think the rest is either on a different distribution on a different distribution or on the Linux Mint Ubuntu edition. So if you enjoyed this video please don't forget to, to push the thumbs up button and also please subscribe to my channel. Have a great day. Goodbye.